Hello and welcome, my name is Maturis. It's Tuesday, so it's factory tour time. And what have we been up to in the last week? Well, I've done a lot. I've been streaming at Satisfactory with uh, WT, but also alone. So I, we've also seen what we've been doing. I've been trying to get a truck road on the way but then disaster strike in the last episode we were building our truck road there it's not yet finished we need to build another pillar there and i was trying to get our truck facility up and running so that that tower is already up and running kind of want to make them more beautiful but as you can see we are quite high so the biggest problem we had was power and well we are kind of high in the sky i also got a little bit bored so i wanted to start on my another project you will show you uh, at the end of this stream you can already see it in the end, back there but well check it out but we are quite high and well we're not going to walk these stairs down because I just finished two more levels of power. This one not connected yet, but I need more plates. But we kind of upgraded our existing one. I kind of tried to find a way to make the elevator work in this section. And as you can see, it goes up in one way and the next level it comes back. And that way the elevator is working perfectly. On every level there is like a jumping pad. It not brings us totally. So I do need the, uh, the uh, jetpack to get to the top level. But it's a pretty nice way to get down. Fast. And as you can see, we already made oh, we made a lot of level. The biggest problem at the moment is bringing the power lines up. It's not like I want it, but when the factory runs as maximum, it comes up to seventeen hundred megawatts. So at the moment, stocks are getting up again, and well, we are using still not enough oil, but I must say this does look amazing. Maybe I should have built elevators in this section as well. Would look nicer. I think we didn't have the elevator when we started this. Maybe we'll redo this. I did redo this section just to make it look nicer. So the truck was kind of a little bit of a disaster. I have to redo that as well. We already built... A station at the other one as you already notice there is no belt anymore because we got this nice baby this 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 is so nice but you need to be careful because it's kind of dangerous car to drive around and not keep your focus so let's head back to the factory it's going to be a little bit glitchy because when this thing is coming at full speed it's getting glitchier and glitchier I hope they fix that in a patch because it doesn't drive smoothly like the truck does but the truck is way slower than well this baby at the moment we are trying to get to sulfur well I can get to sulfur that's not the main problem we discovered the radio tower on your right top you can see it in the mountain shadow is my first radio tower it's just, this thing is amazing it's it's pretty high and we'll go check it out in a few minutes it does take a lot of power in the factory itself we haven't changed that much i did notice we need a lot more concrete so we are going to expand that and we also will need more of other resources so i guess we are going to fix that soon I also want to build a docking station here so that we can load and unload because well the truck got crashed it's kind of glitched in the wall so I had to dis disband it totally uh, sort well 
I guess that is not something we are going to need. And the box is gone at least. The truck was here, but I am going to make a trucking station <coughs> somewhere over there. I'm not quite sure yet. But it's going to be there. It's definitely going to be here. And it's going to be a loading building somewhere over here. And it's going to be fun. So let's get... Kind of amazing. The clouds showing in. Let's get... I still need to do a lot of stuff. Needs to be upgraded to elevators. But as you can see, we are running... At a lot of capacity I upgraded the concrete but it still isn't moving fast enough so I need more concrete that's definitely kind of the basic solution the steel and the steel pipes as we already said this needs to be finished as well need some kind of storage section up there and well I need to redo this as well but the power issue was a big problem and it was kind of hard to fix because I had to bring a lot of resources to the power section but it does look nice we can almost make a factory on that hill I, I kinda want to do that I'm not quite sure what we're going to make but we got an amazing view from all the way up here and well I'm going to demonstrate you what the radar tower is going to do because that's what you guys want to see, the little progress that we made. It isn't much this week, but it is amazing. So I, I had to bring the power up here. And as you can see, this thing is, is kind of doing radar stuff for us. I was hoping it was going to show us the resources as well, but it does not. Kind of pity. But, well... It, this is kind of the circlement it's mapping. So, well, yeah, that, that's kind of the thing it does. I was hoping for a little bit more. I want to build one on the top of that hill. And then we go like that way, build another one. So, let me show you how to get all the way up. Because it's one hell of a way to go up. This is kind of a tricky part, because where do you need to go? And, oh, I'm already doing it wrong. And there's a little plateau here. So you go up here, and in your back is the plateau up. Most people fall off and die. I didn't do that. I had my jetpack on. So this is the top of the rear tower. It's kind of amazing, isn't it? But you can even go higher if you got your jetpack. Right, so now we're on top of the dome. I need to refill again. And now we're on top of the pike. This is looking quite amazing. So, what we should and you can see the top of the electricity tower going up there didn't expect that but i kind of want to make a print screen of this one just because it looks amazing and we are going to remove the nuts in my hand because i don't want to show you the nuts in the hand that way that's how we make pictures was hoping for a clear sky, but it is an amazing view. Wow. All right, now I'm going to show you another project we already started on. I wonder how far I can go with this. I do need to keep a close eye on the jetpack because I don't want to crush. Yeah, Ooh, yeah. And we're down. Right, so the other project I am working on is kind of making a factory out of the star elevator. And it's going to be, going to cost me a lot of time. That's, that's definitely something that it's going to take, but it's kind of fun. 
As you can see, in the end, resources will come in. I expect with tier 8 that we have to shoot the resources in the star elevator because it got entry points. And, well, I kind of want to make it all the way up there. So, this is kind of the top of the room where we are at the moment. So it's not that high yet, but it does give you quite a nice view. And as you can see, we can go to another point with high, with a lot of nice view. Oh man, this is one hell of an overview of my factory. I like these high points. And I guess in the next episode we are also going to show you what we are going to do with all the slugs. Because I need to up the process a little bit. We need more resources and, well, we need more resources over the map. So we are going to build in the truck transport system. We're going to use it because we don't have the trains yet. And I'm going to unlock sulfur with that we are going to unlock the explosion thing and well we definitely need to up the factory a bit because we need more production i hope you guys all enjoyed this quick tour of the factory if you do leave a comment down below what you think of the factory so far and if you got any tips tricks what i should do or what would you like to see because i really appreciate reading those things and well if you're at it Press the like button and press the subscribe button and the little bell next to it. Thank you for watching and see you at the next door next week.